Did you know when you see cool effects like this, that it's really not a 3D model and you can do it for free in DaVinci Resolve. The key here is to set up a 3D camera and that's done through the Fusion page. So stop being so scared of Fusion. Now you can either use a Fusion composition or a video already existing on the timeline. What you're gonna wanna do is take your video or image and connect it to an image plane. We can then connect this to a Merge 3D node and a Camera 3D node. This will put us in 3D land. You might need to move the camera back just a smidge so that your image is in frame, but take the output from your Merge 3D node and connect it to a 3D render node. This will take us from 3D to 2D. Change your render type from software to hardware. And the key for the focal blur is to turn on these settings. Now this is pretty resource intensive so I recommend turning down the quality and the amount of blur initially. You can turn on the 3D camera pivot so it stays focused on a particular location and then we can keyframe the movement of our 3D camera and adjust the focal plane and the only other thing I'll do to enhance something like this is to add a soft vignette on the corners and use Jake Whip's technique of adding some chromatic aberration and a couple of scan lines.